Now we're going to report on a critical need for blood donors, both nationally and locally here in the Ozarks. The effects of the pandemic have made it hard for blood banks to get donors to come in and give. Our Jesse Inman up now at 10 with more on just how severe the shortage is and some of the factors that have caused this problem to happen. Jesse? Yeah, David, today I spoke to the executive director of the American Red Cross here in Springfield, and they talked to me about how things are on a national level, as well as the executive director of the Community Blood Center of the Ozarks, who provide blood for all of the hospitals locally. The American Red Cross provides over 42% of the nation's blood supply. When disaster strikes across the world, the American Red Cross is there to help. But now, Executive Director of the Southwest Missouri Region, Stacy Burks, is asking for your help with blood donations. Because across the U.S., hospitals have struggled to keep blood in stock. What we're seeing is as restrictions from COVID-19 begin to be lifted, we're seeing hospitals resume their elective surgeries and people are getting out more. And so with that comes the additional need for more blood units across the nation's blood supply. In the recent weeks, we've seen hospital demand increase by 30%. But here locally, community blood centers of the Ozarks, they supply about 40 hospitals in the area. All of the blood donated here will end up in one of those 40 hospitals in the surrounding area. Currently, we have about a one to two day supply. We generally like to have about a three to five day supply. Executive Director of CBCO Anthony Roberts says their blood supply was substantial prior to the pandemic, but its effects have prevented their usual methods to mobilize and gather blood donations. Since the pandemic started at the end of March, we've had about 230 mobile drives cancel to the tune of about 7,500 units, which is about 30 to 40 percent of our normal supply that we would have over those three to four months. Now the 40 plus hospitals that they are sole providers for have an increasing need, but the supply isn't meeting the demand. On any given day, we need to collect in the 200 to 220 unit range, and we're only hitting about 160 to 180. Now, Burke says that blood has a shelf life of about 42 days, and there are needs right now for all blood types. If you go to OzarksFirst.com, you'll find links to the websites of both American Red Cross and Community Blood Centers of the Ozarks, and you can set an appointment or find locations there.